coffee up for a couple of hours. I can't afford that. And then I'm going to do a couple of things here. First of all, I'm going to get your bank account online. I I've already explained. No, it doesn't affect you. You don't have to do anything. Once I've done that, I'll go and have a word with Ronnie. Danny, honestly, all right? You're both my flesh and blood. I'm not going to sit around watching you hurting each other while I can do something about it. You can't do anything. He's a grown-up. He's going to do whatever he likes. Thanks. You give her a message from me, OK? For what? You tell her when she's ready. I'll be waiting. So if called upon to do so, how would you feel about having to implement orders that might result in you shooting a man? What? Mum? No! Absolutely not. Mrs Jackson? No, no, no. A trade I can cope with. Engineering, computers, catering corps, pay corps even. But there's no way that he's going on the front line. Mum? No way! What does she actually say? I've already told you. I want the actual words, Danny. It's only going to upset you. Now! Come on! Uh, it was something along the lines of, I'll see that two-faced, you know what, in hell. You are moving into this place over my dead body. I'll sort it, Mum. No, you won't, Saeed. You always say that, but you don't. This is you all over. Jumping in without giving anything a thought. No, this is not going to happen. Hey, OK, Mum, Dad, I know you're worried about the decorating, so am I. Which is why I've called in some professional help. Well, actually, that ain't strictly true, is it? I could never have survived these last few weeks without you. That's what family's for, isn't it? It's me. We're on. <laughs> <laughs>